Today I am going to show the internals of a Dell Latitude 5450. So if you check out the bottom panel here, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, six screws. Do note that the screws can come out, they're not just held in place, unlike later Latitude models. You can put a pry tool at the back to get some leverage. And so this is the bottom panel. with a whack ton of different identifications and stamping and some sponges and this is the internal we got ourselves a 51 watt hour battery with very big font a two and a half inch solid state drive of this is a Dell specific SSD made by some Vendor presumably light on dual DDR3L low voltage memory modules. There's a plastic shell to cover the PCB, a spare WWAN or HCA slot with antennas cable pre run, wireless card over there. I've got one heat pipe to a heat sink here with one fan. So, fan intake here uh, through the bottom cover blows out the side. This is where the display cable plugs into and we've also got very little limited, little access to where the power jack plugs into the motherboard. So the, the power jack is a separate component so if it wears out you can easily replace it. Although I'm inclined to say that the USB ports are soldered although it's not very easy to see with again this plastic shielding, uh, this the way they've assembled this particular model. Let's just, just go ahead and remove the SSD just to have a quick look at it. Um, this is just two, um, some Phillips screws. So these are different screws to the ones used at the bottom panel. Three screws later, okay. It's not marked or anything, but it's presumably a light on drive. LCH256V2S, that's the model number, the 256 gig SATA 3 SSD, made in Taiwan. And you can see that this runs off a ribbon cable, a lot of ribbon cable, like a separate cable. And you can, yep, this is the cable, so to plug in a 2.5 inch drive, hard drive or SSD. There doesn't seem to be any M.2 or M SATA connectivity on this particular model, but I will assume that those were available on the higher end latitude models of this generation. Though, 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 don't quote me on that, as I'm just guessing. Okay, so plugging this thing back in. And uh, what's more to see? I can do a uh, close up speakers are not immediately uh, visible 